New at 10, cocktails to go. A byproduct of the pandemic may be coming back again. Arizona lawmakers are slated to talk about a new measure tomorrow. And it could lead to your favorite restaurants and bars serving up drinks in to-go containers permanently. As Team 12's Rachel Cole shows us, while it may be convenient for a lot of us, not everyone thinks that booze to go is a good idea. We need them to reject this bill. Longtime bar owner Kimberly O'Donnell sharing concerns over the proposed measure known as the to-go cocktails law. It's going to become a long-term solution for a very short-term problem. During the pandemic, Governor Ducey signed an executive order letting restaurants boost revenue through selling alcohol in to-go containers since we had to get everything to take home. But a judge put an end to that in November. My constituents have been asking for That was one part of the pandemic that they really enjoyed was being able at a bar or a restaurant to get a cocktail to go. State Rep Jeff Winnegar, who represents the far Southeast Valley, is behind the measure that would legalize the sale of spirits in the form of cocktails as a way for businesses and the state to benefit. And it's actually great for the general fund because you, it's more of an add-on item that doesn't exist right now. And so with those sales comes more tax revenue without raising taxes. But O'Donnell says the cost coming with liquor licensing for bars far exceeds that of a restaurant and creates competition. We have been closed three different times because of our liquor license being a number six. So they have had the ability to stay open um, and serve food. They're in the restaurant business, we're in the bar business, and I feel that we should leave it that way. As for alcohol delivery, the proposal states the recipient must be 21 years old, putting the pressure on delivery services to make sure drinks don't end up in the wrong hands. We make six Jack and Cokes to go. Who are they serving outside of here? We have no idea where this liquor is going. So far, the to-go cocktail measure has bipartisan support. If it clears several more votes, you could see restaurants start serving to-go drinks as early as this fall. And, of course, we'll keep you posted. Rachel Cole, 12 News.